Wastewater Dam presents Wastewater Math, calculated with Excel spreadsheets. As a new service of ESDLT's Environmental Academy, environmentalacademy.com. Today's example, calculate wire to water horsepower. Today's problem reads, the pump delivers 675 GPM against 290 feet TDH. The pump efficiency is 73.4% and the motor efficiency is 82.5%. Calculate the wire to water horsepower. And sometimes wire to water could, the word wire and wire to water could be interchanged with electrical or motor horsepower. So today's solution um, calculates wire to water horsepower with the formula the wire to water horsepower equals brake horsepower divided by motor efficiency percentage divided by 100. Now, motor efficiency percentage divided by 100 can also be described as the decimal equivalent of the motor efficiency percentage. So we have the motor efficiency percentage in the data in the problem, but we do not have the brake horsepower. So. I'm going to use the calculated brake horsepower in this basic formula, uh, and then I'm going to um, refer you and explain to you the the two bonus videos used in the brake horsepower calculation. So let's go down and first of all let's start with the um, formula to calculate the wire to water horsepower. So you can open up a blank spreadsheet. You can put your cursor in C1. You can type this description. Calculate wire to water horsepower. And then you can put in the electrical or motor horsepower also. Um, you can put your cursor in A1 and format it as whole numbers with one decimal. And you can set it as bold and centered. And then you can go to the formula bar and you can type in this formula equal sign 67.4 divided by three open parentheses 82.5 close parentheses division key 100 uh, two close parentheses and then press enter or the return key and in a1 you will see 81.7 which is the answer to this problem 81.7 wire to water horsepower so that's the answer now let's go look and see how we calculate brake horsepower that's 67.4 so we can come down and we'll look at this first video because brake horsepower uses water horsepower so we have to calculate water horsepower first in order to calculate the brake horsepower so this is the formula this is the calculation you see the url and you see the answer 49.5 and the formula uses the GPM of the pump, the TDH that the pump has to work against, and it uses a hydraulic horsepower conversion factor. So those are the three elements in our data in our problem that's used to calculate the water horsepower. Now let's come down, let's remember this 49.5, let's come down and let's look at the calculation for the brake horsepower, which uses the water horsepower calculation of 49.5 and then it uses the uh, pump efficiency uh, divided by 100 which is the decimal equivalent of the pump efficiency and that gives us a 67.4 brake horsepower and you see the formula the description the url and you see the answer so then you can see the 67.4 how it actually uh, works in our basic uh, formula up here to calculate the wire to water horsepower. So hopefully all three of these videos are useful and helpful. Um, if so, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I uh, also encourage you to participate in Interact. You can do that by uh, commenting or submitting questions through my website, environmentalacademy.com. You can fill out the email form and submit it, or you can send a message to email address on the website. In any event, please come back often because I will be publishing educational videos at least once weekly. So thanks for 
uh, watching this five-minute video and see you soon.